It's an epic journey that started last year on October 16, from the Gobi Desert in northwestern China. The Shenzhou 13 crew are the second Taikonaut team to arrive at China's space station, and they've since have had many successful milestones. <laughs> Wang Yaping became the first ever female taikonaut to conduct a spacewalk, and Zhai Zhigang the first taikonaut ever to conduct EVA activities in 2008 was out twice during the crew's orbital stay. Ye Guangfu had joined the crew's second spacewalk. By then, the trio had made that I feel fine mantra a catchphrase around China. For much of the mission, the Shenzhou 13 crew stayed inside and stayed busy with experiments, management work, exercises, and more, including teaching about space. During two live lessons from China's space station that reached millions of Chinese students. They not only took remote learning to a whole new level, but they also showed how some of the space station's top-notch equipment works and could work in the future. They've also always had answers and encouragement ready for the aspiring young generation across the world, including in the United States. What recommendations do you have for kids like myself who aspire to become astronauts in the future? Thank you. Last winter, for the first time, Taikonaut celebrated Chinese New Year in orbit. And this spring, after six months, the three Taikonauts who have stayed in space for the longest time to date will come home to a world of anticipation and celebration.